gotta stop birthing black kids and birth some mixed kids. I'm trying to, you know, get my granddaughter prepared. She's 11. And yes, I shouldn't be talking to her about, but I do talk to her about and tell her, you know, when you grow up, you need to get you a white husband because you're a dark skin. My granddaughter is a little darker than me. I tell her that you are on the darker side. You when you grow up, so you know, don't just be looking at black men as your own only option. And she's 11 years old, and I don't care who gets mad at it. So, go girl, go girl. <laughs> Andrew, you know, hard facts. You know, this is why I said too, we gotta stop birthing black kids and birth some mixed kids because now they taking our babies. They taking our babies to 18, 19, 21. And I'm happy to hear that 24 year old girl that said that, no, I'm dating outside of my race because they coming after you now. Because they know we're not going for the women in their 30s and 40s. We woke up. We don't want them anymore. So now they taking our babies away from us. 40, 50 year old men are going after our 20 year old babies. So I just want to add that to you, the 24 year old. I wish my daughters, they would have listened to me, but they, they, they just wouldn't listen. Maybe one day they'll wake up. I'm trying to, you know, get my granddaughter prepared. She's 11. And yes, I shouldn't be talking to her about, but I do talk to her about and tell her, you know, when you grow up, you need to get you a white husband because you're a dark skin. My granddaughter is a little darker than me. I tell her that you are on the darker side. You may have some problems when you grow up, so, you know, don't just be looking at black men as your own only option and she's 11 years old. And I don't care who gets mad at it. So go girl, go girl. <laughs> the Andrew, That's you know, hard facts. You know.